Hey I'm Andy, this is the demo for Driftwood and I'm recording this during the Steam Next Fest event and I'll link to the Steam page in the description down below for those that are interested and basically Driftwood is a downhill longboarding game where you're playing as a sloth. It seemed really interesting and like the gameplay reminded me of those downhill levels from the Tony Hawk games. I think there's only like a handful but I could be wrong but yeah I, I, I only recall two of them but yeah, it seemed pretty fun, and it seemed like even this main menu music seems pretty chill too, so you're a sloth that's pretty chill, going, trying to go fast. So uh, let's do the tutorial. I am using a controller for this one, just because like I said, it reminded me of like the Tony Hawk games, and I used to play those with a controller, so might as well uh, keep it like that. So let's move the mouse out of the way as well. Let's see, choose your board and wheels using that so we got a pin we got three boards we can choose from we got a downhill pintail and drop through with the less steering I'll, I'll just do what the one with the most steering steering and we got standard grip wheels soft wheels hard wheels i'm gonna go for the middle because I, I don't know if that the uh, if that will have an effect on speed all right so I, do I need to do zigzag? No. Oh, I have to tap. I have to tap and hold. I was using the trigger. All right, steering. I can brake by doing that. Oh, so that's drift. Okay. Do we need to drift? Oh, looks like the tutorial is going way too fast. So we can do tricks as well. I'm just breathing through this because I know there's an achievement. <laughs> So you gotta try it. I think the achievement is 20 seconds. Let's see. Let's restart. Because the beginning, I totally, I totally wasted some time because I didn't know, I didn't know which uh, button was to accelerate. <laughs> Can I do 20 seconds? Oh, it's like a little bit over. All right, let's try it faster. We're going at 30 kilometers per hour. Oh, I think, yeah, I think holding it down is a little bit faster than just button mashing. All right, I just need to get like the, the fastest line and we're good. Oh, that was, how is that slower? Let's try it. So I'm holding it down this time. I'm going to avoid the circles because I don't know if that will add to the time or not. So I'm going to, after I try and get under 20, I will try to read each one. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh jeez. Like I can, maybe, maybe it's like the board. Maybe that's why. I know I like drifted a little bit as well, so that might have cost me some time as well. I don't know if it said anything about crouching, but... Alright. No! Oh, so close! I'm not even paying too long, like, what, what the menu bar is. I'm trying, just trying to get as fast as I can. I, like, I feel like it's doable with this setup but I, I mean I could be wrong oh geez that is not good <laughs> uh, let's restart I think that was like the first time I've crashed <laughs> I mean at, at least it's more comical than anything or like rag dolly all right well I get it this time I did! Yes, I got an achievement. Fast learner. So apparently you can level? I don't know what the milestone is since this is the demo, but maybe you can unlock new stuff when the full version's out. So let's retry it. Let's actually read through all these tutorials. So pushing, uh, pushing you hold down A on the controller, on a, on like an Xbox controller. Steer using the, the stick. Gain speed or slowly brake by Oh, so I can actually do- oh, okay. 
I was like, there, there has to be a way to go faster. And that one was for drifting. This one is passing close to obstacles gives you points. Some give you more than others. Okay. You can also gain points by going very fast, rotating, or when you get some... How do we get airtime? Sometimes there are objects on the road that you can scatter around for more points. Okay. Neat. Hold X at any point respawns you at the top of the track. Okay. So let's actually try this one more time. I know we're playing this tutorial a lot, but now that I know that we can lean and try and get more speed that way. All right. Oh, I, I hit some gravel. That probably didn't help. Yeah, that didn't help. I, I, hit, I hit the gravel. So let's go back to the main menu. That was the tutorial. This is a real level now. Uh, I still don't know what the milestone is for, like the demo. But I, I'm going to assume it's going to be for unlocks. So there's bridge drift, dead tree dab, and speedster that we can unlock, I guess. Did you? Oh, that, that sloth factor went by way too fast. All right. Let's scatter. Oh. oh, this is a lot harder. So let's, see. all right, we can do it like that. Gain some speed, can we go? We're somehow getting speed on the dirt as well. That is interesting. Oh, we slow down once we're off like the actual dirt stuff. Interesting. So there are multiple paths that you can take. I don't know which one will provide you with the most points because obviously I never played this before. <laughs> oh geez. I broke too hard. <laughs> oh, there's a dirt path. But I think this would have been this, the path with asphalt is a little bit faster. Oh geez. Oh geez. Can I shortcut? No, I can't. <laughs> So you can't shortcut. And apparently I died somehow. <laughs> so I don't know if this is just for a score attack. Oh, there was like the bridge. All right. And so far we're doing okay. <laughs> I say that as I run headfirst into a stone, a rock. I didn't even see how fast I was going. <laughs> right. I mean, it is a little bit challenging at first, but I think oh, it's going so slow. But I think I'm gonna. I think this is time attack. Since I don't see like a timer going, oh, I'm going way too. Oh, 100. I'm going way over like 110 kilometers per hour. Jeez. Do people really go this fast up the longboard? Like, this reminds me of. Oh, we got, we got an achievement in one piece. So, yeah, this demo has three achievements, I believe. And I've already, I already got them all. <laughs> um, but I mean, this this is really fun. This is really fun. Like, if you like these types of downhill, like avoidance uh, skating type games, then yeah. So there is a timer aspect. Let's try it again. See if we can get it faster than two minutes nineteen. Uh, let's see. Oh, that was a weird bug. Let's do the most steering. Yeah, like this. All right. So yeah, as, as I was saying, like the, playing this, like the concept of this just reminds me of Zootopia. I don't know if anyone, oh, oh, that looked painful. Like the concept of this reminded me of Zootopia in the sense that you have these slots working at the DMV and they're 
normally super slow, but then, like, spoiler alert, at the very end, I think, I think the post credits, or something you see, like, the main two characters trying to stop a speeding, a speeding car, and it turns out to be one of the slots. So this, this is what it reminds me of. <laughs> Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Yeah, <laughs> let's not take the turn road. So let's uh, restart. I feel like like the dirt roads might be useful, but for me, it just seems like it hurts more than it helps. Oh, yes, we had it in one go. Oh, that's weird. Oh, yes. Oh, there's like cracks in the road as well. Alright. I, I think the wooden road is a little bit faster because it's banked. Alright, like, even the music is so chill. <laughs> yeah, let's... Oh, that hurts. <laughs> the guardrail. Yeah, the music is so chill, I like it. Even when we're going so fast. Oh! Oh! So, I, like, I don't, I don't know if there's time penalties if I crash. I know I have to restart from, like, a checkpoint, and that itself is a time penalty, but... I don't know if it'll just add more time if I crash or not, so... We went 150, wow. Oh jeez. <laughs> it's like it's violent but not when you crash. It's so weird. Can I make it? I made it. Oh, there's some pinked. No, oh. I think I can do it. I think I can do it. I'm going slower now, so oh, we can do it. Like, I'm not seeing any jumps though, which is... It did say you can get, get points by doing tricks mid-air, so... Maybe in future levels there will be? Maybe it'll be like a downhill jam, like the Tony Hawk games that I remember. And there's like half pipes and stuff. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> so I don't... I'm pretty sure that the demo is only these two levels. Alright, we're almost- oh, we didn't get 10,000. Alright. So, I don't know, did I get- I don't think I got any of the three things. <laughs> but... Yeah, let's try it one more time, and we'll go back to the main menu, see if anything else is unlocked. So, maybe I just have to drift on the bridge, which I didn't before. All right, let's do this in one go. Oh, oh ow. <laughs> right, so I think Speedster is doing this in under two minutes, I would assume. So let's see how, oh. Oh, drifting helps, but it slows you down incredibly, like immensely. I don't know what the dead tree dab is though. Alright, let's see... we got it. Alright. I did see like a log somewhere, I just don't remember where. Alright, was it here? So like you automatically drift. Oh, there, there was the... I think that was that? The dab part? And I think here is the bridge. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Maybe that counted as... Like, air stuff. Maybe that counted for the... The bridge drift, because I did drift off it. But I don't know what the dab is. Ooh. Oh! Oh! Oh, so you, Oh, I, I, I just saw you lose points if you crash. Okay. So there is a penalty other than a time penalty. Okay. 
Oh, this is so fun, though. And it, it doesn't seem like it's graphically intensive as well. At least, I, I didn't look at the uh, recommended requirements, but... Oh, jeez, that's a car. <laughs> Alright. Oh, this is pretty cool. We got our combo multiplier up. Two point three times. Oh, we we broke ten k at least. So did it count for the Brit? Uh, let's just go to men. So there is only two. So I don't know how many it says or how many levels are going to be in the full version, but the demo only has the tutorial and this level. So and there's also I guess ex you can explore. So I, I assume that's free roam in the full version, and there's also customized where. I assume you can customize your board, so yeah. This has been the demo for Driftwood, like I said. I will post the Steam page in the description down below for those that are interested. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, thank you for watching and have a nice day.